All right, it feels like I've been talking about this build forever. I am finally gonna start forging out the seven inch buoy that I have in mind. I'm excited for this because I'm doing some different things on the handle than I've ever done before. It's gonna have a one inch brass pommel and a one inch brass guard, and it's gonna be leather stack in between. I'm gonna thread the tang and use a tang nut to secure everything. And in my head, it looks amazing. So I really hope that I'm actually able to build this knife and live up to my own expectations. So let's get to it. and profiled on the grinder. You can see it's got a pretty nice shape here. I ground in the clip point and I've got a file guide on here that I'm going to clean up the shoulders for the guard fit up with a hand file. And then for the finish on this, I'm gonna hand sand this down to probably about 600 grit and I'm gonna try to get a hamon to pop on here. This is ADCR V2, so a, a hamon should show up pretty nicely. So we'll see how that works out. Let's get to it. This sanded up to 220 grit. I cleaned up the shoulders with the file guide. I've done three normalization cycles and I'm getting ready to quench. Before I do that, I'm gonna wrap steel wire around the blade and then I'm gonna use uh, furnace cement to pack the spine and hopefully get a nice hamon on this after I heat treat. This knife heat treated it's been tempered twice at 400 degrees for two hours each cycle in my next video i'm going to be finishing up the blade and getting an acid etch on it so we can see what kind of a hamon we get i'll also be constructing the handle which will be a brass guard and pommel and stacked leather in between with a threaded brass tang nut on the end so i think this thing is going to look awesome so i hope you come back and check out the next video thanks for watching